Hello everyone, my name is Neve, and welcome to a very, very exciting video. It is a Sunny Angel unboxing. Yay! I have been absolutely dying to open these bad boys, and I wanted to post this video before Christmas. However, I very suddenly and very quickly got very sick. So here we are now for the unboxing. I'm gonna switch the camera, I think, to a flat lay. So I'll do my introduction, and then we'll just pan the camera down and just hands and Sunny's in frame. I think that will work the best. But before we do that, I'm dropping them. Before we do that, I just wanna give a little ramble about my history with Sunny Angels. So before anybody jumps me, I know Sunny Angels are Japanese, but this story does start in South Korea. 2017, to be precise, when I was in Seoul for the first time ever for my friend's wedding, and I saw these adorable little naked babies. I thought, hey, that's so funny. And I swear I took a picture of them in their glass display case cage but I looked through my pictures from the trip and I cannot find it so I guess I didn't but I was just like wow they're adorable and I was thinking about buying one for each of my cousins because you know how kids just find butts and nakedness and everything that comes out of butts just hilarious so I was gonna do that but I was like you know that's gonna be expensive if I get one for each cousin so I did not buy them and didn't really think of them at all since. Then flash forward to 2022 when I found myself back in Seoul yet again and I thought to myself I'm gonna buy those little sunny angels so I bought two of the Christmas ornament I think they were called sunny angels which I did unbox at the end of this vlog so if you're curious which two I got check that out if you would like and when I was unboxing those two little sunny angels the like the happiness and the joy was up here and I was just thinking to myself I get it. I so get it. So flash forward to my most recent trip to Seoul, which by the way, Korea vlogs coming soon. I decided to take my collection of two sunny angels up to a collection of 10 sunny angels. So I have eight here to unbox, which excessive, yes. Will it bring me joy? Double yes. I did actually purchase 10, but two of them were for one of my cousins who specifically asked for some. And I do have a clip of the two sunnies that they got, and I'll insert that at the end to keep it a little surprise. And yeah, I'm so excited. Let's switch the camera around and dive into the unboxing. Yay! Alrighty, here's what we're working with. We have two of the Winter Wonderland series, two fruit series, two animal series version one, a vegetable series, and a sweets series. If anyone is curious where I purchased these, as I did say, I got them in Seoul, South Korea. These six so excluding the winter wonderland series i got in latte young plaza they were 9800 won each and since my purchase was over 75000 won i got a tax refund of 5000 won so my total spend for these was 73400 won which i was charged 52 euro and 98 cent which worked out at 662 each then these two i got in art box for 10800 won each so 769 before tax refund and now that the basic information is out of the way let's start unboxing i think we'll save the winter wonderland you know best for last save the best for last so we'll pop them aside then I think we'll start with the ones I have duplicates of and then do the singles. So yeah, we'll probably start with fruit series, then animal, then vegetable, sweets, then winter wonderland. And I'm so excited. So let's zoom in, get a bit closer and start unboxing. First up, the fruit series. Here's what we have, 12 kinds plus secrets. I have to say, I love pretty much all of these. I think they're all very easily recognizable and iconic. Maybe not the Dorian, just because that's not a very common fruit in the region of the world I'm in. And maybe also the dragon fruit, she looks a bit funny. My top three are probably the peach, because this is one of the first Korean words I learned. So it holds a special place in my heart. Love the peach. The strawberry's also really cute. And the pineapple. But I do also love the apple. And the pear and the orange and the raspberry. And pretty much all of them. So... Pretty much anything I get, I'll be happy with. Here he is. I did not do that in the most graceful way. What do you guys think it will be? Oh, I don't think it's the pineapple. His head feels too short. Here we go, you guys. You'll probably see before I do. What'll it be? <gasps> not the dragon fruit after what I just said. Oh, but he is so cute with his rosy cheeks. So yeah, we have pulled the dragon fruit. 
Oh, okay. Let's do the next fruit series. Maybe I'll open this one from the bottom. I don't know why, but I want to. I opened that much better. Now knowing my look, this is probably the Dorian. What'll it be? Oh, it's melon or honeydew. Oh, that's really sweet. Okay, yay. So here's our two besties. Oh, I feel like they complement each other really well. Oh, that's cute. We have melon and dragon fruit. Oh, look, they're under each other. Oh, okay, yay. I love them. Next up, we are doing the animal series. We again have 12 kinds plus secrets. My top three. This is hard. I think the frog and the tiger because evidently I love frogs and tigers. I also really like the rabbit. The dalmatian is great too. So is the koala and the panda and the sloth. The top three would probably be frog, tiger and rabbit. I don't love the owl. I think that's a strange color for an owl. Also, I feel the monkey looks more like a sunny monkey mix as opposed to a sunny angel wearing a monkey hat so those are my opinions about these frog tiger rabbit or the elephant oh they're all cute i think i'm not going to use the blade this time can i just open it with force oh i can oh. it seems easier to open them from the bottom let me see if i can tell what it is oh i feel something I think it's the elephant. I feel like I can feel the trunk. <gasps> it's the elephant. I can see blue. Ah! We got the elephant. This little trunk I could feel. Oh, yay. Oh, I like the elephant. It's cute. I did complain the owl wasn't a realistic color, and I guess this isn't a realistic elephant color, but still. I'm happy. Let me see if I can tell this one as well. <gasps> I think this might be the frog. Am I correct? Oh, not a frog. Oh, it's the polar bear. Oh, yay. It's a little 360 of the polar bear. He's got little blue ears. Oh, they kind of not really match. They're both blue. Oh, besties again. Belly bash. Bonk. I'm gonna do the vegetable series next to match my fruit series. Here we have the 12 kinds plus secrets. I love cauliflower, but I don't think I love the sunny angel cauliflower. If I just looked at that in general, I don't think my brain would click straight away that it's supposed to be cauliflower. I love the corn one. I think that's really cute. And corn just reminds me of Korea. And since I got these in Korea, I would like the corn. I also think the radish is really cute. So is the carrot and the tomato. Oh, and the garlic and the onion. Okay, top three. Narrow it down, girl. I think corn, garlic, carrot. How can you not like them all? They're all very cute. Maybe not the eggplant. Let's open. And this one, we only have one shot. Let's see if I can tell. Oh, that feels bumpy. Oh, but what a step. I don't know. I can't tell. Here we go. Oh no, <laughs> it's the eggplant. I keep getting the one that I say, mm, maybe not that one, but you know it is cute because it's purple and I love purple. Oh, his eyebrows, are they purple or am I imagining that? They might be brown, I can't quite tell. So here is the eggplant, or as we like to say, the aubergine. Gorgeous. He's just by himself because, like I said, we only have one vegetable series, but we'll get a sweet series to join him. Okay, last but not least, before we do the Winter Wonderland, we have the sweet series. 12 kinds. I love the strawberry shortcake. I really want that one. See, doesn't the popcorn one look pretty similar to the cauliflower? Hmm. Anyway, I love the strawberry shortcake. I love the ice cream. I love the candy. I like the pudding. My top three, strawberry shortcake, ice cream, and candy. Or a strawberry shortcake, pudding, and candy. I can never have a top three. I don't know why I decided I would say top three when I either love them all or love majority. I think I'd be happy this time. There's actually, actually, I'm lying. This one, I'm not sure what this is. This reminds me of rainbow drops. I'm not sure that's the same thing. I will have to Google that. Fruit tart's also really cute. Let's see. Oh, 
I'm such a pro at unboxing these now. What'll it be? I don't remember what this is, but I like it. Oh, it's kind of green. It's looking like matcha strawberry flowers. What is this? Because I do not recall. Oh, this is a cupcake. I don't, I get, oh, I guess it's not green. It's more brown. Okay, okay. I see the vision. Here is the cupcake. Oh, you up there. Oh, this one's so silly. Look at his hair. He kind of looks like Bart Simpson here. He can be besties with my vegetable series. Last, we have the Winter Wonderland series. I'm very excited about these. Let's take a look at the options. Okay, let me pop this off because it's kind of blocking our view. Probably going to take the plastic with it. Oh, no, it's not. Alrighty. Six kinds may contain secrets. Koala, bear, reindeer, Dalmatian, rabbit, fawn. And then we have a 1 in 36 chance of whatever that is. It kind of looks like a puppy. A 1 in 36 chance of... Mm, looks like a mouse. 1 in 48 chance of something with pointy ears. And a 1 in 144 chance of getting... Is it, he called Robbie? Sorry, I'm not very like up to date on the sunny angel lore i just visually enjoy them i can't really even choose a top three because that's half of them these are all very cute i guess the reindeer is particularly winter wonderland as is the bear i really like the rabbit it's very iconic let's open it up and see what we have these boxes are nice and wider oh there's something inside is there something inside all the boxes okay we have a white bag that's his feet it's feeling flat cap so maybe I think it's the Dalmatian. Oh wait, is that an ear? I don't know. I think it's the koala. My guesses are usually terrible. What do you guys think it is? Oh, I saw a bit of green. It is the koala, right? Is that, is that a koala? Yes, this is the koala. Oh, the details are really adorable. Okay, so a little green hat with a white pom-pom. Gold ears, pink head, green mittens, the purple scarf. Oh, the mittens, I think, are what does it. Such an adorable detail. Oh, sorry, just look at the box. I want the Dalmatian because it's holding a tiny Robbie. That's really cute. So the koala. I love the pastel theme. Let's do the next one to see who his partner will be. Oh, that's cute. He may bring you happiness. May? He does. Oh, yeah, sorry. There was something inside the box down there but i'll just grab this one i'm assuming oh this is a leaflet of all of them yeah i'm pretty sure i got this last time i got the christmas limited edition ones i can show that at the end if you like okay well let me feel it since i'm super pro with that i can't lie this kind of feels like the koala again it's definitely not the rabbit no big ears maybe it's the dalmatian oh i think this is the dalmatian it's the Dalmatian! Oh, I love that he's holding the little Robbie. So here's the Dalmatian. Oh, stop it. Okay, obsessed with the Dalmatian. Different colour. Oh, the cat is actually a different style. Dalmatian has blue eyes, gold spots. The little Robbie, that's really cute. It's like a snow Robbie. This is so sweet. I like how these have more detail. Yay! But yeah, here's this squad. Which one is your favorite? I'm kind of obsessed with all of them. If I had to choose a favorite, choosing a favorite child is hard. But probably this one because his mini Robbie just sells it to me. Aren't they adorable? Oh my god, I actually love them. I need a minute just to stare at their beauty. Those are my new additions. I'm obsessed. Moving my new babies out of the way. Or actually, you know what? They can stay. This little leaflet just comes inside. I'm pretty sure it just shows. Yeah, minifigure, regular series catalog. And if this is your first time coming across Sunny Angel, here's the cute little story. Should I read it? I was letting you guys read it. Sunny Angel is always by your side to protect you, cheer you on, and make your everyday life a little more delightful. Place him around your house or around your desk at work, and his calming presence will surely bring a smile to your face. <laughs> Look at the outline of his butt. So we have the Animal Series version 1. Ooh, Animal Series version 2. Oh, the skunk. Oh, I need the pig. Oh, that's fun. Animal Series version 3, I would like the zebra, very much so. Version 4, sorry, it keeps going. Version 4, oh, an alpaca, a peacock, a 
Calico Cat I Want It. Sweet series we unboxed. It's on the other side. Marine series. Ooh. Oh, the whale. Oh, a dolphin. Is there a shark? Oh, oh the seal is really cute. Blowfish. Flower series. Oh, the cherry blossoms. Oh, no, the cactus or the acorn. Sunflower. I just like everything, to be honest. Fruit series we did. Vegetable series we did. Is that all the series there are? I guess the other ones are special series. And yeah, that's the little catalog thing you get. I think only with the special series or limited series. One more view. And those are all the new additions to my Sunny Angel collection. I'm obsessed. Don't be scared or alarmed if this time next year my collection goes from 10 Sunny Angels to a thousand. It could. It's definitely a possibility. Thank you so much for watching this video and being part of my channel. If you would like to subscribe, please feel free. I would really appreciate it. Feel free to leave a comment on which is your favorite Sunny Angel or which one you're in search of or which collection you like. There's a really cute cat one. I didn't see any while I was in Korea, so I don't know if it's older, which is what I'm assuming, or just super popular. I think it's probably just older. They're very adorable. I would love one of those. And yes, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and hopefully I'll see you in my next video. Bye!